Nearly $23 million in funding is going into Indiana school safety plans this upcoming year. Yeah, CBS 4's Eric Graves asked schools how they're planning to use the money first. 425 Hoosier schools are getting tens of thousands of dollars each to help make schools safer. This year we set another record with the amount of money awarded and the number of applications. The money comes from the Indiana Department of Homeland Security. The Secured School Safety Board reviewed the applications and Director Rusty Goodpaster says schools decide what they need most. There was enough money this year to fund all eligible number one priorities schools submitted and more. We felt that this year the training of officers and or staff was an important issue. So if that was a priority number two, then that training was also funded. The Central Indiana schools we spoke to decided to focus its grant funding on school resource officers. They have such an impact on our students and staff on a daily basis, and we can measure it. Chase Lyde, the chief of police for Avon Community Schools, says this grant is helping Avon at a seventh SRO the most the district has ever had on staff. Our school resource officers are the face of safety for our entire program. Hamilton Southeastern got the max $100,000 in grant money. It's using the money for SROs as well. Mike Johnson, the director of safety for the system, says the right people go a long way because school safety is so much more than the nightmare scenarios most people think of first. We know that it's way more likely for us to deal with an injury on a playground, for example, than it is to have to deal with an uh, assailant. Johnson says they have to be prepared for anything and everything, though, and every dollar helps. In Indianapolis, Eric Graves, CBS 4 News. Other Marion County schools were also awarded as much as $100,000.